Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ, and anyone else who happens to see this video. Today is Friday, June 26th, and it's 6.14 p.m. Oh, I thought he was throwing up. Oh, well, anyway, this is about, um, I'm trying to find out what the latest is in everybody's state on the COVID restrictions. Are they being rescinded? Now, <clears throat> someone told me it was on the news. Now, I just did a search. I couldn't, there wasn't anything new that popped up on Google. And usually, I know that Google, Gmail, and all their associated relatives, Facebook, most all social media, is gathering information on you. Everything you research is, is um, it's stored. They know what you research and, you know, where it's leading to and so that they can rate you, I guess, that, that you're, uh, you know a whole lot versus, well, you only went here. You don't know as much. I don't know. I just know that some people won't use Google, but it's just that I usually get what I want. Local news, whatever. And there was nothing there about it, our local news from yesterday that somebody was saying that there are more restrictions now because there are now more cases of COVID. I was told that we had more here at our in the skilled nursing on the skilled nursing floor and also the last couple days could have been because it's raining though there's been nobody sitting outside on the patio and there has been being gatherings but the pillows were probably wet you know so Maybe maybe they were just meeting somewhere else indoors, and I didn't know where. But anyway, the point is, I got this in my email today. Well, actually, I'm sorry, June 24th. I've been holding on to it a couple days, thinking I might want to look at some of these articles. I might want to do a video on this. Okay, I started to watch the video on Dave Hodges and Celeste Solemn who is a former FEMA official. I've talked about her before. She was going to detail step-by-step -step plan to destroy America. And I'm like, you know, I was hardly into it. And I couldn't watch anymore. We all know it's coming. It's going to happen. But we should be out of here and not see it. That's how it should be. If you are ready... If you love the Lord your God with all your heart, mind, soul, and strength, and your neighbor as yourself, and your actions prove it, and you're repenting and living right, you should not be here when it happens. But anyway, in the meanwhile, we may have to go through a little more of this then it may be worse than what we did already these past three months. It says here, coronavirus cases exploding in Texas as Houston hospitals near max capacity. And this is a publication called Natural News. I can't hardly read it. The world's top news source on natural health. Thanks to the widespread complacency and disinformation from the alternative media that told Americans masks don't work, coronavirus cases are now exploding in Texas, Florida, California, and other U.S. states. Okay, 
So hospitals in Houston are at 97% of capacity for ICU beds. And with hundreds of new infections per day, largely from younger patients now, the hospitals there will be overrun in mere days. Now I get an Israeli, um, not Israeli News Live, that's a YouTube channel. It's just Israel AM, I believe is what it's called. And every single day this week, it has the top story is so many hundred new cases in the last 24 hours. Today, it was like 400 and um, let me see if I can find it real quick. I've just been deleting them because it's been all about the number of cases and I'm like, Good grief, why is Israel, you know, because they're usually real careful about travel. Uh, well, this is really weird because it's, it's bouncing all over the place. This all at the top should be today. Let me go here. Israel AM. Okay, here we go. The health ministry has reported 441 new coronavirus cases in the last 24 hours. See, that's what I'm talking about. Every day this week, the top story has been several hundred new coronavirus cases. Partial lockdowns and new restrictions have been placed on neighborhoods in Ashdod and Bayam. Anyway, that's to show you it's increasing over there okay let me go back to my inbox to where i was but this person is saying that the alternative media i guess that's like youtube has been telling americans that masks don't work well that's the truth even tony fauci was caught in a interview with somebody saying that they're not Viruses and the, the, if you sneeze in one or even cough, that forceful air will come right out of your mask. And if you're wearing, if you're wearing, you may be wearing a mask, but you're less than six feet away, it could still go through your mask. So not only does it give you a false sense of safety, you're also get, decreasing your own oxygen. I think the six, the social distancing would be better, but that's something we should do every flu season if you don't want to catch the flu. But you may think, you may, if you want to keep your body healthy enough, if you take proper amounts of vitamin D3 and, and you need, I'm on 5,000 international units a day. Okay, I'm supposed to be on 4,000, but I increased it to 5 just because I can take one pill instead of two or four. Hey, hey, what are you barking about? What are you, hey, hey, stop barking at my pillow. Stop it. You're too loud. Forgive my puppy. He hates my heart, my heart pillow. Because the first night he was here, it scared him. Jasper, 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 stop. Okay, so this natural news must be more like from mainstream media. Hey, hey, stop it. Stop it, Jasper. It's okay. Oh, my goodness. Anyway, uh, could anybody chime in and tell us what's going on in your state? Because perhaps I know some of you still watch the news. I, I know they exaggerate cases. I'm sure there's... You are being too loud. You're being too loud. Stop it. What is wrong with you? Hey, hey. Ah. 
Look at that. He's wanting to get near me. He's barking at that red pillow. No, maybe not. What is he barking at? Jasper? What is it? Let me look. Hold on a second. Did something fall down? What are you barking at? Stop barking, please. You're too loud. Everything looks the same. I did hear something fall down over there. Maybe I'd better anoint with oil again tonight. Anyway, I just been okay, I just wanted to report that. How cases seem to be going back up already. And it's not even, I mean, it's barely summer. It's summer now. It's barely summer and already, you know, because people have laxed up. We, they have restaurants open now. I mean, graduations have taken place, but they had to wear masks. See, that just goes to show you. People have to wear masks, and yet the cases are going up. Social distancing was still in place. Cases are still going up. Why? Are they just being testing colds, and that makes it go positive? That's what I'd like to know. Are they just increasing testing? And because so many people have coronavirus in them, is the tests just turning positive and they've just got a cold or had a cold? I don't know. I don't know what to think. Y'all let me know. Leave your comments in the description box. I mean, <laughs> no, not the description box. In the comment section below. All right, thanks. Bye for now. I'll talk to you later.